Hello and welcome back to 100 Coding Challenges in C Sharp. This is episode 9 and it's called Age Category Selection. In this episode, the challenge is to ask the user how old they are and then we're going to tell them whether they're a child, a teenager or an adult. If you want to give this a try yourself, then hit that pause button now and we'll get started real soon. Okay, so let's begin. We're going to start off by asking the user how old they are. So, go on the right line, how old are you? And then we're going to take the input from the user and store it as an integer. So we're going to convert to int32 on the console read line. And then we'll do this in order from youngest to oldest. So what we'll do is we'll say if age is less than 13, this means that if they're anywhere between 0 and 12, we're actually not doing any validation on numbers below zero. That's a completely different topic. Um, but we assume that the user is entering a number between zero and uh, and twelve, and we're going to say that they are a child. And then we'll have an else if. In here, we'll say if the user is less than eighteen, then we can tell them that they are a teenager. And then in our else statement, we can say that they are an adult. So I could have actually had this as 12 if I said less or equals to. Um, that essentially does the same thing because if it's if I just had less than 13, then 13 would actually not fall into this segment here. Um, so. So I'm going to just leave it like that, um, just to show the two different ways we can do it, but you could have done it either way. If we run it, how old am I? If I say I'm five, I am a child. Um, let's say I say I'm 15, I am a teenager, and I'm somewhere, let's just say I'm 18 actually. Um, and it says I am an adult. So this is because I said it's less than 18, not less or equals to 18. If I checked 12, um, it would say that I am a child because here I'm doing less than or equals to 12. So I hope you guys got that one. Another simple one, I think. Um, let me know how you guys did in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.